awesome guys then you know, I just realised I do this every single time I do something on green screen I end up putting on a green shirt give me a minute I'm going to go change out my shirt okay okay that's me back I have changed my shirt now there we go not green probably going to work with the screen yeah anyway today I'm going to be reviewing reviewing well I was going to be reviewing The Last of Us but so we'll stick around anyway I was going to be reviewing The Last of Us but I haven't finished that game yet so what so I'm going to be reviewing all of New Vegas. It may contain some, yeah, some of those. But anyway, overall, I thought it was a really good game. I did enjoy Fallout Three, which would make sense if I done a, um, a review on that first, wouldn't it? But anyway, um, yeah, it was a really good game. Great playing and everything like that. Had some. Quite difficult choices, especially towards the end, where yeah, somebody say it, you had to choose between teams, and if you chose the Legion, I hate you, because I was really hated by the Legion. The Legion absolutely hated me. I really wanted at the start. I really wanted to join the NCR, but I started sliding towards follow it. Followers, is it followers of the apocalypse? Yeah, I'm sure it's followers of the apocalypse. I started to kind of slide towards them. We doing certain missions. But then, uh, towards the end, I started going to the NCR, but then I wasn't completely loved by the NCR. I was, but then I got the partner, Cassie, who was an old ranch wrangler, I don't know, cowgirl, what does it call her, cowgirl. She made, there was missions with her, which you had to kill a few people, which kind of made the NCR kind of hate you. So I was like... I can't remember what the title was, but I was no, I was kind of like loved by the NCR because I've done a lot of good stuff, but I have done a lot of evil, so I was considered very evil, but I'm praised for the good stuff I do. So this is actually quite a short review. I thought there'd be a lot to review, but there isn't really that much to say, except for it's a really good game. There isn't many vaults. I don't, I don't think I discovered every location in the map because usually I play it through the story, then I replay it again. But I never done that with Fallout New Vegas. Because I only found two vaults. I found Vault 21, which was turned into a... It was turned into a hotel. It was in the actual Vegas Strip itself. Which wasn't very destroyed because, you know, they destroyed, like, nuclear missiles that were about to hit before they actually hit. So the town's pretty... Town, would you say? Town... Sh the Strip was pretty reserved. And there's, um... Where's my friend called? There's Vault, I think it was Vault 19? I think it was, don't quote me on it. But it was Vault 19, it was a vault that was quite weird. Especially seeing it in the desert, it was filled with trees and greenery, grass and everything like that. And it had a lot of insects and I hate insects and I hate plants. I hate them. I don't know, I like touching a wee bit of plant near me really. Like, Ugh. It's like a flower, I don't that, but it's like ivy. Or like moss. Uh, I don't have a bug phobia, I'm alright with bugs. Completely alright with bugs, just in the game, didn't want to touch them because I knew they were mutated. They probably had some sort of weird stinger, but I don't know. They're scary. But, um, what else was there? Any? There was also another strange thing. Well, talking about the vaults, you, the vault shirt you're wearing is Vault 17. Never found Vault 17, but it was Vault 17. Maybe the grass one was Vault 17, I don't know. But I might play through it again to see if I can find any other vaults. Or if you want to know any other vaults, try and search it up. There was just another place I found. I was walking about the place. I was like, I saw the through these mountains. I said, wrong, we're going to say white stuff. There was this white stuff all along the top of the mountains. I didn't know there were mountains. I thought, well, it must be like some sort of eco dome or something like that. Because I thought it was quite strange. I was walking and seeing fir trees. I saw the top of the mountain. I was like, is that snow? And it was, there was snowy mountains and everything. It looked like some sort of, like a snow cabin. It was like some sort of ski resort. But it was inhabited by super mutants and some night skins. Well, I can't actually remember the night skins. They were called something else. But at one of the missions, I had to hunt night skins, which are these half coyote, half snake things. You had to hunt them, but I didn't actually complete that mission. So at the end, it was saying what happened. Everyone had said hey, there was no cure, so you went out terrorizing towns a lot. Something like that. But yeah, in the end, they destroyed quite a lot of Legion people. And I was quite stuck in the final mission. The final mission, you have to defeat this big guy. 
pretty big guy. He's got quite a scary mask. I actually pulled his mask and I killed him just to see how funny I looked. But um, I found a sword kill him, but I managed to kill him. It's kind of a glitch in the game. I threw a grenade. Um, then he went. Um, he went. It fired him. He went flying in the air. While it was in mid air, I used the VAT or VAT, whatever you call it. I threw the grenade at him and it hit him and blew up. And but that didn't actually kill him. What killed him was the fall, so I didn't even kill him. The fact they threw up, I don't even know if the grenade even hit him when I threw it at him. But the fact is he died because of the fall, and that's how I completed it. And what they said was, like, at the end, what they said was, like, oh yeah, thanks for that, and I just said, oh, well, I need to get some rest. He was like, okay, and that's it, so I go through the store, and that was the end. That was it, just game finished, there we go. So overall, yeah, Fallout was a good game. Also, all these games on their reviews on their PlayStation 3, so you might not say they're amazing graphics, but for them, they were quite good graphics, good story mode, good choices, good perks. I never fully perked up my character, by the way, but got some quite decent perks in there. I don't even think I fully leveled up. Like, I don't think I even locked all the perks. I did finish the game quicker than I thought. I finished the game last New Year's, and just by the way, it was, it was Christmas Eve I finished it by the way, but um, just to say you haven't seen me since last year, it's my first video in 2017, and I actually have less hair than I had the last video I done. So yeah, no, right, um, hope you enjoyed that review, Red Ghost out.